guys, Sunny back with another video and today I'll be showing you a quick and simple tutorial on how to back up your Samsung device uh, such as Samsung tablet or Samsung phone. Now this is very easy, just follow step by step on what I do here. I'm not going to go through the installing process on installing the uh, actual uh, program, just showing you how to download the program and actually click on the backup option. This is a very simple tutorial and you have to follow this video if you don't want to mess up. So let's get started here and I will leave this link in the description below right here. Um, for the Samsung Smart Switch website. Many people don't know about this, that Samsung provides this. A little bit of a background, Samsung Keys used to be the uh, backup tool and restoring tool, but then that stopped getting supported until the uh, Galaxy S7, Galaxy S6, and uh, the Note 5 came out. I believe, I don't think the Note 5 is supported by Keys anymore, so they did make this uh, program called Samsung Smart Switch, and it's an app on a PC that allows you to backup, restore, and restore from uh, previous backups that you've made. Now, you might want to do this just in case you uh, rooted your device, or before rooting or after rooting. You could do both. Um, this is just to preserve your data, and this will not back up your root. I repeat, this will not back up your root. This is only for backing up your apps, your data, your uh, documents, your photos, anything like that. So I will be showcasing. And this is the Galaxy Tab 4, 10.1 inches here. And uh, it's running uh, Android 5.0.2. This will work with any Samsung Galaxy device and any Samsung Android version. So let's just get started here. Um, so you want to go to this website. After going to this website, you'll see these three download links on the uh, right hand side here. So click on, uh, it'll say get Samsung Smart Switch for mobile. Um, you probably already have this if you have the Samsung Galaxy phones. Samsung Smart Switch for PC or Samsung Smart Switch for Mac. And just decide on whichever uh, computer you have. I have a PC here, so I would click this, but I already have the thing in the program installed. You will get this right here. As you can see, it says smartswitchpc.exe. I've canceled it because I already downloaded it. After doing that, you want to install the program, and then I have mine right here, as you can see, where the mouse is pointing on the taskbar below. Samsung Smart Switch, you would just click it, and the UI cannot be simple enough. It is just a simple user interface and it's friendly, don't worry. It it will give you three options after I plug into my device. So here is my device. I'll just plug that in right now. And I have named my tablet, uh, tablet. So the name is tablet, as you can see. I am not unplugging the device. As you can see, it says uh, tablet right here. Don't worry about this. Uh, if you have iTunes installed, it would, uh, show this but don't worry just click on the X here and this is the user interface here so here's the backup option here's the restore option and here's the outlook sync option but I don't use that I use backup and restore um, you can also update your device here and if you click on the down button it will give you the model name uh, internal memory and the Android version so that's my model here that's my Android version that's how much storage I have now all you want to do is just click on backup and then just wait for your data to be backed up now mine won't take that long um, mine might take a minute but if you haven't backed up your tablet or device you probably didn't even know that this uh, program was out there this will take some time as this is the first time your device is being backed up um, I've known about this it's just I never got a chance to actually make a video on it Sorry, I just finished my exams, and uh, I'm back at it again with the uh, YouTube videos on the how-to tutorials. And, uh, yeah, that is it. So, just wait for this thing to uh, back up your device. As you can see, it does say it is backing up my script calculator, which is an app I just installed for this video. Uh, backing up applications. So, I have 47 apps on my tablet. Uh, 
so I might just forty I might just forward this uh, to make this video short. I'll be right back. So now that the backup has been done, this will this will pop up here. It'll show the total size of your backup, um, the backup date and time, the device it has been backed up from, and the uh, succeeded slash excluded. Uh, so the cat these are the following categories that have been backed up successfully. Um, I also forgot to mention if your device does not connect to the computer, number one, you need to install the drivers that I think the uh, Samsung Smart Switch app uh, provides for you. Uh, and number two, you want to swipe down as soon as you plugged in your device. If this does not connect to your computer, you want to plug in your device and swipe down. You will see this right here, um, connected as a blank device. Mine is connected as a media device because I set it that way. If yours says something different, just click on that. And click on uh, click on the box that says media device. So uncheck the camera and check the media. Then it should work for you if it did not connect to your computer. Now all you want to do is just click on OK. And then you can now uh, restore it if you want. So if I would have clicked restore, then you can uh, select a backup of your choice. So if I wanted to click select from backup, um, here is the backup that I just backed up to. So you can have your Samsung device. And then here's my S8 that I have already backed up previously. But this is the previous uh, Samsung tablet that I backed up um, before this backup for this video. So you can then restore from backup. So let's just click up another backup. I can just click OK but um, that is it so and you can also update your uh, tablet from this so this program um, which is also really good so that is it for this tutorial and it's just very simple just click on backup or restore you can restore your device too if you want to like just start it as new but that is it for this tutorial and I'm just uh, just wanted to share this with you that many people didn't know that you can uh, back up your your Samsung device like iTunes backs up their Apple device um, many people didn't know that Samsung made this app and now I'm just sharing it with you so you guys can uh, back up your device just in case something happens with your device or before or after you want it to root your device so that is it for this video hope you guys learned um, a lot from this hope you guys uh, found this helpful and uh, that is it for this video so so don't forget so don't forget to subscribe and like and if you have any questions leave them in the comments below and I will see you next time peace